Hi students, I'm Brittany from Teach Blog Travel, also known as Ms. Roberts, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can share a PDF online that you've already made editable with something like PDF Escape or Kami. Now, you can use the same method if you want to share PDFs online that are not editable too, but that's usually the application that teachers will want to use it with. So let's get started. I'm going to share my screen with you, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask that you go ahead and open up a new tab if you haven't already. That way you can follow along with me step by step. The first thing you'll want to do is log in at luminpdf.com. You can see the address up here, it's l-u-m-i-n-p-d-f.com. Once you're logged in, you should see a list of all of the PDFs that you've already uploaded. I'm going to choose this one. And I'm just going to go ahead and click these three dots that you see on the right hand side. A few different options will pop up. We'll click share. Now, this is very important. Before you copy and paste that link, you have to make sure that the sharing settings are going to allow them to see it. So if you just click sharing settings, you'll be able to see who can get onto the PDF. Make sure it's set to anyone with the link and make sure that you have selected what you want for them to do. If you want for the person receiving it to be able to edit it, make sure you have edit clicked. Once you have your settings the way you want them to, click save. Once you've done that, you can click copy and then you can simply paste anywhere you want it to show. Maybe on the wall of a Google Classroom, in the stream post, in a comment, via an email or text, Really, the possibilities are endless, but do make sure that you've set those sharing settings before you copy and paste the link. Now, after you have shared the link, you can make other changes to it, but it will change their access to the link if they've already received it, so be careful. That's pretty much it. Super simple video today. I hope that was helpful. Until next time.